things. I have received an entry from Christine of Kauai Memo Love, and this is an entry for my 4K giveaway. I can see right on top we have a card. I'm going to open this up. Oh my goodness, look how pretty that is. That's beautiful, and I love it. Aww. Dear Jovi, very happy to participate in your Road to 4K celebration. I made a few tags and ephemera pieces for your home sweet home journal. Sincerely, Christine, Kawhi Memo Love. Ah, uh, and then on, uh, just so you guys know, on Instagram, her IG is eoru one so it's E-E-Y-O-R-E-R-O-O-1. -O -O so you could check her out there as well. Thank you, Christine. I can't wait to dig into this pile. I'm very excited. <laughs> Beautiful card. I want to thank you for that. Oh, goodness. Look at this. This is a beautiful bag with this sweet gingham bow, and I love gingham. You know what, guys? Let me make sure that you can see everything. Let me back my camera up. There we go. Now you guys can see everything. Okay. So this says, remember this, a house and a butterfly. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Let me scooch these over here and let me untie this bow and see what goodies await inside. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my goodness. How cute. All right, let's take a look. Oh my gosh. It's like um, the cutout is like that you would wrap um, thread around, but she turned it into a tag, which I love. All the comforts of home. Oh my goodness, memory lane, home is where I'm with you. Oh, is that ever sweet. These are beautiful. Just roll with it. Oh, that's so cute. Life is what you bake of it. Oh, <laughs> these are so cute. Oh my gosh, and look at this. It's got like the little tab on it. It says Dairy Certified Quality Milk Cream. Oh my gosh, these are fantastic. Routine. A sequence of actions regularly followed. Routines are the ideal way to bookend your day. I think they are the building blocks of effectiveness, efficiency, and efficacy. Mike Vardy. I don't know who Mike is, but he's spot on. Then we have this one. Look, it's so beautiful. She's cooking. She's got a little apron on. There's a house and the bow. Oh my gosh, Christine, these are gorgeous. I'm going to put these down so I don't drop them. Oh my gosh, beautiful. Look, they're so tiny, but they're so cute. Cakes and cookies. Aunt Cleo's Midwestern Baking Recipes. And then Best Recipes for Baking Cookbook. Oh, how darling. These are so cute. I love them. Home sweet home. Oh my gosh, these are so inspirational. Thank you so much. And look at this, a pocket made out of a doily and it's got this band around it with this cluster on top. And then we're gonna pull the goodies out of the pocket. I love that, that's so beautiful. And then what do we have here? First of all, we have a tiny paper clip, which is so stinking cute. And then we have our cards. Don't be afraid to take whisks. <laughs> These are so cute. Oh my goodness. Cake is my happy place. Oh my gosh. Baking Queen. These are just fantastic. I'm in love with everything. Look at that cake. I don't know if I ever told you guys this, but I just have a thing about cakes and cakes being really pretty and and, and I, I think I love the look of them more than I love the taste of them, but I do just think, well, even desserts in general, I just think they're beautiful. <laughs> There's a little note inside this bag. It says, I also included a few cute goodies. Ah, that's so nice. Let's have a little look. Well, this is just so fun. I feel like it's my birthday. <laughs> Let's see what we have in here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you won't believe this, but I literally 10 minutes ago just had avocado toast. <laughs> so 
This is great. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, me and my daughter love avocados. So this is great fun. Oh my goodness. Oh, and look at this. Is this ever cute? Oh goodness. That is precious. I have a feeling that my daughter is going to try to snag this from me. This is so cute and it's so squishy and I love it. Oh, that was so nice. What a wonderful and fun extras these are. My goodness. And we have avocado banana milk hydrating mask. Oh, I can't wait to try that. Man, oh man, that looks wonderful. Ooh, how nice. I'm gonna give myself a little self-care. <laughs> I need to do that. <laughs> I need to give myself some self-care. Look at the stickers. Oh my gosh, these are great. Well, thank you so much, Christine, for my wonderful extras and my wonderful tags and, and goodies over here. I just, everything is amazing. So I really appreciate you joining in and spoiling me. You certainly have spoiled me. So thank you for that. Friends, hang tight. We are going to make an ATC for sassy Southern North Carolina girl. All right, friends, our friend Jen, Jennifer, at sassy Southern North Carolina girl is doing a challenge to grow her channel and she would like us to send her an ATC. She had a couple of different themes. One was summer and then the other was Paris. So I think I'm going to go ahead and go with the summer theme. You can see that I am using a playing card which fits perfect in the holder that she has for all of her ATCs that she'll be receiving. And so that's why I'm using a playing card. So I scuff it up because it's shiny and that way it takes the shine off so that the glue will adhere to it much more effectively and you know like probably forever. So that's how I start and let me get some summary stuff. I've got my information that I'm going to go ahead and add to the back of the card and that'll fit just perfect. I'll give that a little scuff as well. All right, I got that adhered on. Now we can just focus on this side of it and have some fun. To be sure to mention that she did say that she would like for our cards to be mostly flat because she does need to fit them into the sleeves. So just wanted to let you know that. We can still layer things up and, and keep them interesting and, and be flat at the same time. I'm gonna glue this onto the paper and then I will trim around the edges. I've got the background paper down. Now I'm just going to go ahead and add this layer. So I'm going to cut that to size. And since the corners are rounded on the card, I'm going to go ahead and round them on this piece as well. Got this cute little piece. And this was actually a piece from a calendar. You know how in the back they show you all 12 images in a miniature size? Well, I cut them out and I'm using them in different projects. And so I think I'm going to go ahead and put this right here in the center. Clearly this is too wide for the card and even too long, but if I go ahead and cut it, I can put summertime up here and then on my mind can go down here. And I think that's what I'm going to do. And I even wonder... I don't know if I could do it straight, but I'd, I'd even like to make these just a little bit smaller, but I don't know if I can do it on my paper cutter. Let me see. First, let me make sure that I cut that edge pretty straight. Yeah, not, not too bad. There's a small error right here. If I just cut that off, then hopefully that's straight. Yeah, that looks great. So now, if I even if I just hold this, here, if I line it up with this white line, it's so small and they move around a little bit when we do this, but I'm going to try and let, let me make sure I'm not cutting the T off. Yeah, the T's going to get a little cut off, so let me push this in 
with this and then maybe I can do it stable and straight. The reason I wanted it smaller was so that it doesn't cover up, you know, like all of the fun colors going on in here. I was thinking for fun, I might add these at a little bit of an angle. So if I do that one at that angle and the same angle for the bottom, I just think it adds a little bit of fun. So I'm gonna do that. Here it is, guys, my finished ATC. We have summertime on my mind and life is beautiful. Enjoy the ride in a summer theme. I hope she likes it. Go check out Jen and help her reach her goal. I'll try to remember to link her video in my description box. Thanks for watching. See you soon.